Congress Neta Digvijay Singh has, uh, you know, ended up seeking proof of the surgical strike. This is another controversy that we are talking about. This is a big piece of breaking news that we have for our viewers. As Congress's Digvijay Singh has uh, raked up another controversy that refuses to die down. This is to do with the surgical strikes, uh, quote-unquote surgical strike, a term that was coined by Prime Minister Narendra Modi after the big Uri attacks. And uh, now the Congress is once again asked for proof of the surgical strikes, uh, something that had happened in the past, like I said, refuses to die down. And Digvijay Singh of the Congress party is once again raked up this entire controversy. Bulwama ke ghatna hoi. Jalis se jada humare CRPF ke loog maare gai. Kyo maare gai? CRPF ke loogo ne diya director ne maang ki thi ke sensitive zone hai in CRPF ke javano ko hawaii jahaz se Shri Nagar se Dilli bheja jai. Lekin Modi ji ne mana kar diya. क्यों मना कर दिया आज तक उस घटना की जानकारी ना संसद में उन्होंने पेश की ना जनता के सामने रखी दैट वॉज कांग्रेस लीडर दिग्विजय सिंह seeking proof of uh, the quote unquote surgical strikes that uh, have been claimed time again and again by the center remember this was in response to the 2019 pulwama attacks that occurred on february 14th in the year 2019 one of the worst terror strikes in the state of jammu and kashmir ever since the uri attacks had happened and this of course had taken the lives of 44 CRPF personnel who were killed and several others who were injured in that attack, uh, the Pulwama attack, pretty much uh, something that was uh, being spoken of uh, by the Congress leader Digvijay Singh as well. Now, in the same breath, he's also gone ahead and questioned the surgical strike, the retaliatory attack that the Indian government claimed that they had done on Pakistan. However, time and again, the opposition has uh, sought proof of the attacks uh, nothing really has been mentioned by the government uh, and this is why this controversy refuses to die down as uh, uh, once again this is uh, congress leader one of the tall leaders of the party the grand old party mr dik vijay singh sparking a row questioning the surgical strikes again taking this uh, also by uh, what is the kind of response that has come in from the bjp over this controversy bjp shehzad punawala has responded let's take a look ahnc ka naam badal kar use ppp kar dena chahiye indian national congress nahi pak parast party kyunki bar bar congress party kaha pakistani narrative aur dushprachar ke sath 370 par unka dushprachar phailaya phir surgical strike aur balakot air strike par phailaya aur ab digvijay singh congress ke varishth neta पुलवामा का दोष भारत पर डालते ये पहली बार ऐसा नहीं किया जा रहा इससे पहले भी अधीर रंजन चौधरी रणदीप सुरजेवाला ने पुलवामा का दोष पाकिस्तान से हटाकर भारत पर डालने का कुछ से प्रयास किया था भारत को ही दोषी साबित करने की कोशिश की गई थी 26 ग्यारह के बाद भी किताब विमोचन करके दिग्विजय सिंह ने उसका दोष हिंदू टेरर पर डालने की कोशिश की समझौता मालेगांव ऐसे कई सारे ब्लास्ट है जहां पर इस्लामिक जिहाद को क्लीनचिट देते हुए पाकिस्तान को क्लीनचिट देते हुए भारत पर ही उसका दोष डालने का प्रयास किया गया और फिर सर्जिकल स्ट्राइक का भी प्रूफ मानते हैं दिग्विजय सिंह कहते हैं कोई प्रूफ ही नहीं है ये वही पार्टी है जिसने बालाकोट एयर स्ट्राइक पर भी सवाल उठाया और कहा कि चील कौवे मरे थे बार बार सेना के मनोबल पर चोट की जाती है पिटाई हो गई सेना की यह कहा जाता है सेना के शौर्य पर सवाल उठाए जाते हैं गलवान में तवांग में डोकलाम में सेना के ऊपर सवाल उठाए जाते हैं और आज सेना के मनोबल पर चोट पाकिस्तान के जो पूरे नेरेटिव है उसके साथ खड़े रहने का काम बार बार कांग्रेस पार्टी करती है इसलिए भारत जोड़ो यात्रा नहीं ये पाकिस्तान का दुष्प्रचार जोड़ो यात्रा है और इसीलिए आज 370 के निकाले जाने का भी एब्रोगेशन का भी विरोध कांग्रेस पार्टी अभी तक कर रही है Across to my colleague Pallavi Ghosh, who joins us on the broadcast. Pallavi, once again, this entire uh, controversy, which is to do with the quote-unquote surgical strike, has been raked up, and this time again by the Congress Party. Of course, BJP is up in arms about this. 
you know it is very surprising when this kind of a comment has come in from digvijay singh because i remember after the last lok sabha elections when there was a stock taking internal report and in that report it was very categorically mentioned mm. that you know when you start questioning the surgical strikes you give that huge advantage to the bjp and that's one of the main reasons why the congress came up with a disastrous performance mm. it is seen as being anti national questioning our army and also uh, you know giving in to those uh, uh, the narrative which is put forward by our opponents like pakistan mm. so just on the eve of the end of the bharat jodo yatra which is happening in 30th and now when the yatra is very much there in jammu and in kashmir mm. and also of course big elections coming up in karnataka rajasthan as a run up to the big 2024 lok sabha elections the bjp cannot be blamed if they've got this issue on a platter which has been handed out to them because once again they'll start asking this question of the yatra that is the intention of the yatra to unite the people or actually destabilize the country right palavi thank you so much for that so that uh, controversy has obviously erupted after digvijay singh made those comments at a public gathering this of course is as the bharat jodo yatra has entered the valley uh, from jammu it is now going to go to kashmir as well and it is going to culminate on the 30th of january so in the fag end of that yatra these statements of course will snowball will go out of control because it's once again questioning the surgical strikes uh, uh, going back to my colleague pallavi pallavi the point that you were making that it is feeding into what narrative pakistan has set in questioning the surgical strikes however when it comes to the government at the center they have not managed to nip it in the bud either the, uh, this controversy and this uh, questioning of the surgical strike like i mentioned earlier has been happening ever since why not come up with a foolproof uh, answer to just nip this controversy in the bud but they have to be fair to mm-hmm. them i remember even when <clears throat> Uh, this entire controversy was talked much much earlier mm. and just after election there were some like mamta banerji some like the congress party who also alleged that the surgical strikes were engineered for political and electoral purposes the government had also done a series of press conferences in fact the army had also done see these are sensitive matters you cannot give up mm. operational details that's not what your uh, optics are all about yet the government had gone on record the defense minister himself had gone on mm-hmm. record the army pro had also gone on record and they had given limited evidence to show the entire procedure of those strikes mm. how the uh, opponents across the border which is pakistan in this case had actually been challenged mm. but beyond that if we expect a complete transparency that's mm. not acceptable that is not even expected because as i said that these are operational details because of sensitivity cannot really be divulged mm. but having said that this issue which the congress party had realized is going to boomerang on them and they had been somewhat silent on it it's now been raised and reignited by digvijay singh no less mm. who's of course a very veteran senior congress leader but more than that this comment is also being made when the bharat jodo yatra is in a sensitive area like jammu and kashmir yeah. where you know our army or our forge are deployed over there in very tough conditions so mm. this question will also be raised by the bjp that why is it that the congress party not even giving the value to our forges mm. who are struggling so hard to ensure that we are safe Absolutely Pallavi thank you so much for that taking this across to Major General AK Sivaj who's a defense expert who's also joining us on the broadcast Major General Sivaj thank you so much this statement by Congress leader Digvijay Singh once again questioning the surgical strikes uh, Congress and other opposition parties have done this time and again and this is back in the discourse how do you respond to this uh, you know very unfortunate you see the point is that the surgical strike which has taken place in Balakot is uh, proved beyond doubt indian mm. army has come on the record and conveyed to the country man that as to how this operation was unfolded you know certain uh, details which are operational cannot be divulged mm. to and even even within army so the point was that there was no doubt left the whole world knows it there was a satellite which was being was monitoring including of the us and even the pakistani has accepted it and if you see the comments coming from pakistan there after the surgical strike has taken from balakot it has been conveyed time and again by pakistan that this operation was conducted by india 
और द सर्जिकल स्ट्राइक विच वॉज बेसिकली कंडक्टेड बाय गोइंग इन साइड बाय बाय द स्पेशल फोर्स ट्रुप सो बोथ टाइम वेदर इट इज बालाकोट और सर्जिकल स्ट्राइक कंडक्टेड आफ्टर उड़ी बोथ वर एक्सेप्टेड इवन बाय पाकिस्तान सो वी मस्ट अंडरस्टैंड यू नो वेन वी स्टार्ट फॉर आर पोलिटिकल गेन स्टार्ट क्वेश्चनिंग द क्रेडिबिलिटी ऑफ योर योर ओन आर्मी इज वेरी अनफॉर्चुनेट दे मस्ट अंडरस्टैंड इट विल बाउंस बैक इट विल बाउंस बैक ऑन दैट दे क्रेडिट